So when you want to transfer files from your server to your local system, then how will you do that? So there is a command called rsync for that. Uh, from where you ha just have to uh, use it to log in into your system and then it will transfer uh, to the, uh, the files to your desired uh, destination in your local system. So essentially you will be providing uh, the IP address and the login details of uh, the remote system and then the path of uh, the directory on your local system where you want to paste that uh, particular or copy those files. So the command is rsync uh, which is the, uh, available in the most of the Unix and uh, uh, Linux based operating systems. Um, so rsync space there will be options so we will be using a hyphen a which is for uh, transferring the data in archive format which preserves the settings of uh, the files and folders so uh, all the permissions will be saved all the uh, timestamps will be saved which is really important um, r is for recursive uh, which means that it will the command will recursively uh, in every directory uh, um, and the files within those directories will also get transferred so if you want to transfer absolutely every single file then hyphen ar is like very much needed then you are providing the username at the rate ip address of the machine so it can be your server's ip address and then the source uh, path and then space colon uh, the destination path which is uh, in the local in your local system so then you have to provide the password to log in into your system so rsync is basically asking uh, the credential or credentials or password of your server of that particular user so ip address is 192.168.1.41 and uh, we have uh, the username uh, Goran. so so password of Goran at the rate 192.168.1.41 is asked by the rsync command after you press enter and uh, and so there is a path uh, which is separated by uh, colon between uh, which is between IP address and the path and then tilde is the symbol which is, uh, represents uh, the home directory so the path is relative to the uh, home directory and then space the destination of uh, uh, the destination on your system where you want to paste those files so it will be like um, so it is uh, dstr sync uh, slash so all those files and folders after getting executed will be copied from the source to the destination folder so it is asking for the password uh, so we will be just entering the password and now the transfer has been completed so we will just uh, get into the destination folder and uh, we can see the detail uh, delete folder and we can see the files which have been transferred so we have this particular file and this particular file and the folder which is uh, created uh, is in the left side which is untitled folder so all the files and folders which were supposed to be transferred were transferred in the destination folder so this is how we use our sync command in Unix and Unix based shopping systems. Thank you for watching the tutorial. Please don't forget to click on the subscribe button for receiving more updates from being skilled.